what's going on everybody in today's video we just drove the truck as you can see we took the suburban out into pennsylvania to pick up a new seat for the e36 because i had so many dms on instagram and text messages from you guys about my seating position in the one video because the seat was all the way back and i was driving like this and everybody wants to talk smack saying nice seating position bro bet you got scoliosis like no i don't have scoliosis the seat is broken i tried to fix it when i was 17. i decided enough was enough and it was time to get a, you know like a bucket seat and originally i wanted the reclinable one but i couldn't find any so i was like fuck it dude low max for 300 bucks like and it has a bracket like the brackets for a coupe but we're gonna see if it works in a sedan three hundred dollars that it was like a hundred percent a rep seat because it's a very heavily replicated seat it passes the legit check am i gonna really go into it no <laughs> if you see me at meets don't look too close at it just in case by the way we are with gage today hello all right guys so we're at the home depot today <laughs> we just got the bride here's a better look at it it's a lomax of course and like I said, I don't want to look at it too close, but like so far it kind of passes a legit check. Like this is like a different material, but it's like the same color. But then again, the seat's old, so it's faded. <laughs> it has the tag on it that matches. But we have to get mounting brackets for these, or mounting bolts for these screws right here. So I figured, hey, what better way to make sure we're getting the right bolts than to bring the bride into the Home Depot. So as you can also see, this is owned by an E36 owner, but I wouldn't be surprised if deep down he was a real GTI boy because it has this stupid ECS tuning sticker on here. Like literally, well, I'm not going to start talking smack in case they want to sponsor me. But <laughs> needless to say, this is coming off. She's a little scuffed up. Maybe we'll put some of our own stickers on here, but check this out, dude. Legitimate bride, low max. The brackets Damn. in the car like this shit is like gangster as fuck you feel me like this is going in the e36 and i still haven't sat in it yet i don't even know what it feels like dude, you're probably gonna be low in that thing bro. i know dude i was thinking about it on the drive home i was like dude i might have to like stack some pillows up on this thing <laughs> like sit on top of those like old head seat covers <laughs> yeah already oh, hell eyes on it Dude, if we were if we were like a prank channel, I could like put this up on a shelf and just be like, can I get a price a price check on this? <laughs> Dang, these bolts are all in bags still. Which one looks like it would fit? Not the long. Maybe these? Or probably That's not. a tiny head. I know. Look at that. Look at that. Open package. We're almost back at my house and Gage got too excited about the brides. He got a he got a nose. I'm actually good right now. Bro, it's like born I can, out of I can, I can feel all over my teeth. So we got the fasteners from the Home Depot. We're, we are almost back at my house Help. now. And Help Ga me. <laughs> I'm gonna go pull in my car. Kind of sketched out to use this. What if it, it feels, tears it? Yeah, it it's feels, a hard bristle. Feels abrasive, dude. Oh, he's loading it up. Yeah, that's no the, games. That's the. Suppose that's in. <laughs> so, with the seat in, and if I'm driving. It'll be like this. I don't know if it's supposed to be angled this way or not, because it feels a little weird. But anyway, I'll be driving like this, whatever. But don't fear, because I could still drive it like this. Because I know you guys love that for some reason. I mean, I got a lot of a lot of room. I think it's supposed to be like that. That's like five, six fingers. Oh, dude, this thing's going in fucking tight as fuck. Definitely cross threading. <laughs> yeah, that motherfucker was cross threading. <laughs> oh, you have a 16 mil wrench? Oh, I didn't say that. <laughs> I'm gonna say nobody has a 16 mil wrench because Harbor Freight doesn't sell them. Because they're the same size as 5.8s. How about that? How about oh. that? Let me learn you kids a little something. Got me caveman in this bitch down by hand. Yeah, yeah I know. What you doing down there, man? 
Um, I'm zip tying wires. And uh, wires is the nickname for my seat bracket. Now we're not gonna drive it like this. We're only doing this for pictures. We are not driving with our seat zip tied, zip -tied to the car. In. The seat is installed. This is how it looks. It's definitely not held in by zip ties now, you know? No, see, since we're now taking the picture, we're gonna remove the zip ties and replace it with a fastener. But for zip ties, I mean, it's pretty stable. It's we replaced the zip tie with a bolt. Yep. There's a bolt there now. Yeah. It definitely feels more like a D car than it does a stance car now. <laughs> like this thing feels like fun to drive. No traction control, man. That's deleted. We're about to hit the 200,000 mile club. What am I at? 198. 198. Yeah, Dude. so there's the the real Bride Lomax install. This is actually comfortable. That's not shut up. Hey, thanks for watching the video. The seat is installed and it went perfectly smooth. That's all the time we have for today. Gage. Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.